I read a previous interview of yours where you spoke about the credibility of the character vis-a-vis -vis Hollywood and the Indian film industry. I thought that was a fascinating comment to make, and I just wanted you to elaborate on that a little bit. Can you elaborate your question? <laughs> In terms of how the character actor is treated on, say, vis-a-vis -a, -vis a Hollywood set as opposed to a set, and the opportunities that you have in terms of roles written for the character actor in, as part of an ensemble <clears throat> on a film. See, when you're doing a Hollywood film, you don't feel like a character actor because you are an intrinsic part of the story. Mm. You are a very defined cog in the whole machinery. Here. When you are doing a character actor, you are a character, just a character. <laughs> you, you are there to support the protagonist uh, crisis or his dilemmas, whatever. Your own existence doesn't exist. Hmm. There, the character actor's existence exists. They are themselves has a kind of roundness to it. And the definition of why they are there in the story is very precise. So we misuse character actors for the, for the main, main lead. That's why here, doing a character actor is no fun. You are, you are, you are, you are bracketed as a character actor, then the story doesn't come to you, you are, no, you are not there to deal with the story. For an actor, there's nothing exhilarating than dealing with the story. What the director why the writer has written that story, what is the nucleus of the story. You want to deal with that crisis and you want to bring your own take on that. But there, even if you are doing a character actor, you can explore these points. Here, you are just there. That's the difference.